the touch gloves, touch them now. Good, let's step back. Good luck to both. Scott Trade Center is jam-packed and thick with anticipation. Ken Shamrock versus Kimbo Slice in our main event. You ready? You ready? Get it off! The bell in round number one. Kimbo pointing to the center of the cage. I think he's daring Shamrock to stand and trade with him. Shamrock wants none of it. Tonight's Fight Clock is brought to you by Miller Lite, the original Pilsner. Cheers, it's Miller time. Outside trip hit by Ken Shamrock. He's wearing the blue gloves, red gloves for Kimbo Slice. One of the problems with that size disparity I talked about is going to have a hard time holding Kimbo down. Got the takedown, couldn't keep him there. Rock with wrist control. Lead to the body. Slice said Shamrock is most dangerous in the opening three minutes, then I think he will fade. And Shamrock wants to keep the fight here. There's not going to be a punching range with Kimbo. The problem is this is very taxing, especially if you're the smaller guy and they break. There is the separation. Level change, the single leg, and hit by Shamrock. Now taking the back. Both hooks in. Well, that was an easy takedown for Ken. Looking for the rear naked choke. A bit of crank on that. Oh, it's under, under the, the net. Chin. That is tight. That is very tight. Shamrock looking to finish. The I think he's got it. McCarthy taking a really close look. Kimbo's not tapping, though. He is still fighting. How long can Ken hold this? Because positionally, this is done, but he's just not able to put enough into it yet. He's out, I think. Nope, nope, he's still with it. Saw that arm drop, but he's still with it. Shamrock full commitment, but has crossed his angles. Lost both hooks, still deep, still tight. But if Ken doesn't get this, will he have any arm strength left? And Kimbo's out. Slice back to his feet, and unloading with the right hand. It was all Ken Shamrock. 